something making my ears ring a little bit. Look at this. Holy crap. They totally should have left a bunch of this stuff in the game. Some of the stuff is wild. Welcome back. I am a friendly pest. And today I'm playing Into the Radius 1.0. Playing on an Oculus Quest 2, streaming this game from my PC over Airlink. And today is going to be a good day. Maybe. Because I've got a new mission that I just accepted. The Harvester. I have heard of the harvester. I have never seen the harvester, so I have mixed feelings about this. I'm supposed to take a photograph of this thing uh, and eliminate an escort, a homunculi or something. I don't know what that is either. Um, supposedly here, there's a camera. Up here is a harvester, whatever that is. So we're going to get out there and we're going to find out. Uh, feel like I'm under equipped to deal with something like this so I might use some of my money I don't know like I'm tempted to just buy a scope for the Nagant but also I might have enough money that I could buy something worthwhile but I don't have a ton of time to think about it you know I'm trying to get this recorded I've got so much I need to do right now let's see what we can come up with I, I don't know. Something with some range would be fantastic. Like I could start, I could start getting myself into an AK for the amount of money I have. I've got 58, 46. I could get the uh, the 74, and that would be decent, especially if I could put some optics on it. I think it would be amazing, but it would be really decent. That's probably the smart thing to do. I've got quite a bit of experience with that weapon, um, which also makes me kind of not want to get it. it. Makes me want to get something else. But I don't think I can afford anything else. We'll think about this for a few minutes, and then we're gonna pull the trigger, so to speak, and uh, go for it. And here's my Mosin. Uh, So what do I do? Just get a scope of the Mosin? But that's like two grand, I think. Let's see. Yeah. That's a lot of money just for a scope. You know what I mean? That's a lot. It's so close to just buying an AK, but I really need the range. We're going to go out with what I have and see how it goes. That's what we're going to do. And I'll probably come to regret this. If I if I pull this off, this mission pays very well. If I pull this off, uh, then I should be able to buy whatever I need. Let's do a quick item check. I've got my spare panic pistol and magazine. Uh, two meds total, a little bit of extra ammo. Got my Makarov. Little food, spare knife, knife on arm, probes. Um, I don't know if I have any grenades. The average adult gamer asked me to see if the old grenade trick worked on uh, on the shock anomalies in this version of the game. He asked something else of me also. I don't remember what that was right now. Um, I don't have any grenades, and I'm not going to spend any money. So, we'll just go out there and we'll see how it goes. We'll get started. We'll see how it goes. We'll see how it goes. I'm nervous about it. I'm nervous about it. I've heard tell of the harvester, but I've never seen the harvester. Hope everyone's having a good week. This will go up on Friday. Whenever you find this video, hopefully it finds you well. I'm feeling a little better than I was last week, but I'm also very tired also playing without my contacts, which I'll explain on the other side of the fog. Oh? 
save. Where are we? Way over here to the right. First time ever spawned this far over here. There we go. Playing without my contacts today. We'll go straight up the road and cut over the canyon. That'll be fairly safe. Unless it's created special mobs just for me on this little adventure. Which is possible. My left eye is bothering me. It started last night when I laid down. It was, it was fine all day. And then when I laid down, it was like I got sand in my eye. You know, there's not sand blowing around in my room. So, I uh, tried to wash it out. Tried to look in the mirror. Pretty comfortable messing with my eyes because I wear contacts. And I've worn contacts for several years. So I'm pretty comfortable holding my eye open and looking at it, touching it and stuff. I don't see anything. There's no debris on the eye. There's no debris in the eyelid. Don't know. Uh, so today I wore my glasses, which I don't normally do, just to give my eye a little relief from the contacts. Um, and then, of course, my glasses don't fit comfortably inside my Quest 2, even with the spacer. And I don't want to risk scratching my lenses, so I'm playing without uh, eye correction, which means I can't see. I can't see. Uh, but it's going to be fine. I'm like, what... What could go wrong? We're going out to find something called the Harvester, defending by homunculi, uh, and we can't see. I think it's a trademark of mine that I go forth unprepared. Okay. I'm moving a little slow today. I'm going to sprint a little. got some stuff rattling around in my brain and I'm trying to decide how to broach it. Um, really digging in hard on the self-improvement stuff right now. So what I'm going to do with that is on the Discord, I'm going to create a self-improvement category. Fill it with a couple channels. Here you are. Let's go through Many to go. In these self improvement channels, I will include my daily exercises. If anybody wants to follow along, whatever I decided to do that day, it's going to post it there. Uh, and if you want to follow along, let's do it. I'm also going to share whatever song come across my playlist that spoke to me the most, like a link to that song. So. You can check it out if you want to, the song that spoke to me during my workout, which I've got kind of unique taste in music during exercise. I don't really uh, just go for like the heavy metal stuff like a lot of people. I like uh, something measured and thoughtful whenever I'm working out, which is weird. It's weird, but you can check it out, right? In this channel, we can get together, we can work together, we can better ourselves. Right? Because the first step to bettering the world around you is to better yourself. I believe in that strongly. I bet I could climb up in there. The better you take care of yourself, the better you feel, the better you can handle things. It makes a huge difference in your life. And I'm getting shot at. Yeah. I can't. I can't deal with him. I can't see. We have to go this way. That's all right. Should have bought the scope. It's gonna be fine. I don't think they'll leave the block post to come after me. And if they do, we'll learn something. If I get up on this rock, doesn't look like it. This is gonna be like a little dead end. Check it out anyway. 
dead end. Well, we might be able to skirt out and around. Keep our eyes peeled. See as well as we can see, despite our poor vision. there to get around and backtrack maybe could be in here nope ain't going that way perhaps let's have a look that's it how do we get there Check this way first. See, in the Discord, I see... I see a lot of depression. I see a lot of people kind of lost within themselves and what they want to do, unhappy with themselves. I know a lot of that stuff's normal. A lot of the people that watch my content are younger. It's tough to be young. It's tough to be young. It's not your fault. It's chemical. You're growing fast. All these hormones are cranking. Your emotions are all over the place. You're mad at everything. You hate everything. You're so mad at yourself. You're so sad. Then you feel amazing, right? It's not your fault. It's not your fault, but you gotta put that energy somewhere. And I'm telling you, exercise is great for that. It feels good to exercise and blow that energy out. How do I get through here? fast. The stupid fog is going to come back. Up there and across, maybe. Get up in there. Can't grab that. Oh. Stuff like that's tough. Stuff like that's tough. I understand. Oh no. Let's come back. I'm not just saying I understand. I do understand. I was there. I was there. I went through it. But like inside yourself, you think nobody's ever felt like I feel. Here's the camera I needed for the mission. Put that somewhere handy. We gotta roll. It's a stupid fog again. I'd love to get up there to the Katia. This is ridiculous. Is there nothing I can climb? I'm sure something in here is climbable. Maybe this wall? You start taking care of yourself, physically, mentally, and like actually taking care of yourself, not this isn't very popular. 
but there's this like this huge motion that I see online and social media, and this this is the, this is the dominant ideology. So I'm I guess I'm opposing that. So take that for what you will. But there's this huge idea that being comfortable is good for you, and comfortable is going to make you feel better, and it's not true. Hello. What was this? I wonder. I don't think it was anyone's house. It's too big. So maybe it was some rich bureaucrat's summer house. A few of them had those. I think I'd like to live in a big house one day. Ironically, when I was living in our little apartment with my parents, an apartment of my own was the height of my imaginings. But after all this time in the darkness, I keep dreaming of a big house with big windows and lots of open space. Would you want something like that? When you get out of here, I mean? Do you dream of getting out of here? Returning to normal life? I guess we don't really know what life is like beyond the zone now. But what if it's just like it used to be? People living out their lives in houses big and small. Wouldn't that be nice? We'll save our progress. Probably gonna load my save if I die. I know that's against my philosophy in general. Um, my goal is to make headway, not to relish in the pain of the experience. I've done that for over 80 hours. I have relished in the pain of the experience. Back to what I was saying. Like, if you got your if you get your act together and your your health is good and you go out and run and you lift weights, it's like your brain chemistry works better. I'm telling you, you'll feel better. Everything else that's really eating you up will not be as big a deal as it is. So join me in the Discord. Share in my workouts. Let me know what you're doing. Go back and forth. We'll drive each other. We'll hold each other accountable. We'll make progress. We'll hold, hold each other to a standard. And we will improve ourselves. We'll improve our lives. We'll improve our communities. We'll make the world a better place. And it starts with taking care of yourself. And it sounds crazy. But you have to. That's the way. That is the path to feeling better. Look at this little shelter. Check the UAZ. Note to self, I overheard one of the Estonian scientists in Vano admit he crashed his UAZ near a ditch. He said it was in the forest that feeds the wetlands east of that half-constructed office building with the crane. Cool stuff and things. Fatigue level's okay, so we're not going to sleep. A grenade. Average adult gamer, I will be attempting to test uh, what you requested. Let's crack on. Let's go see what a harvester looks like. It's getting dark. What time is it? No clock on here. Clock there. Pretty late. We're going to go ahead and sleep. Never slept out here before. what happens other than being hungry that went well what was that I guess we'll take it but I brought food give me the food away we go really do like this sounds so stupid it sounds so pretentious i think of people that interact with me and share their time with me and watch my content i think of you as more than just subscribers i think of you as more than just viewers i think you of you people that i have taken interest in your lives and i want you to succeed and i want you to be happy i want you to feel complete i want you to be content i want you to do things that make you feel good uh let's work together on that stuff you know what I mean? Let's look out for each other. If you see something I need to be doing, let me know. You know what I mean? Hold me accountable. I think a, a real friend does that, right? Uh-oh. Where are you? Up there? There's one.
Let's see what happens. I don't know if you're supposed to pull the pin or not. Let's try to pull the pin. No. I don't even really know if that worked. I don't think it did. Sounded like something took a shot at me. Let's get up here and listen. Come on. Is he stuck on the rock or something? Damn. That was perfect. Okay. Whew. Pretty happy with that. Let's try to cut left of these ruins and see if the shock anomalies are maybe clear. Watch out for this time ring. We'll get up there. I don't think being comfortable is good for humans at all. I don't, I don't think we're wired to expect it. I think we're wired to seek it. But that wiring came from a time when it was extremely difficult to be comfortable. Watch out for vines, too. It's not very difficult to be comfortable now. Another ring. There's the vines. This is unbelievably treacherous. Save. We're getting close, but we're making terrible time. Shock anomaly. I think they're out on the left. Should have stayed on the road. The amount of anomalies in the woods is excessive. I think throws so well in this version. Okay. Getting tired of picking up crap I don't need. There it is. There it is. Something huge moving back in those trees. Get a better look. Damn. Get back on the road. Something making my ears ring a little bit. Look at this. Holy crap. They totally should have left a bunch of this stuff in the game. 
Some of the stuff is wild. Alright. Let's find this harvester. This thing's supposed to be nightmare fuel, so... side of the road will be okay. Something's shooting at me. Everything's so damn aware. There it is. That's a nice shot. Mission accomplished. <laughs> Run away. Guns acting stupid. We got our picture. I feel okay about heading out. It's supposed to be, it's got these weird things that kind of teleport around and defend it. Um, and I don't know how durable they are, I don't know how dangerous they are. But that could be a problem for another day. I feel like today was Something big making noise. Today was pretty productive. We're getting paid. Important thing, get home with this money. Right, we're gonna get some serious money for this mission. Get home with the money, use that to buy some better gear, that then I can more confidently push on something like that. Because the, the Mosin does not feel amazing in this version of the game. I don't feel like it even hits that hard. It doesn't, doesn't not hit hard. Something shooting at me from somewhere. game today. I think this leads to the block post, which unfortunately will be defended by two mimics. A little box of ammo over there, we'll pass on that. Take a look at the route. Yeah, if I go this way I'm going to have to go through the block post. 
or we're gonna try to cut right and go around it, which is the smart route. Here's a ring again. Can I go that way? Great. Dude, relax, bro. Uh -huh. I'm feeling pretty good about today. Got to check out the harvester, which, uh, I don't know. I'm not exactly let down by it. My expectations were so high. Uh, because I've been told, you know, not what it was, but that I should fear it. That it would be quite an experience to meet it. And it's it's definitely a force to be reckoned with, near as I could tell. Not that I stuck around long enough to really learn anything about it. But also, I mean, it wasn't immediately on me in some nightmare scenario, and I was so screwed. I was, I was able to leave the area pretty easily. And I don't know how lucky I was about that either, but it didn't seem like that big a deal. You definitely want to keep your eyes open for it. I don't know if it can be killed, but today, it didn't kill me, yet. That's a win. And get done with this, I'm going to do some more working out. Uh, went pretty hard yesterday. Yesterday I ran, well I walked uh, three mile per hour for five minutes, and then I ran, or jogged, five mile per hour for 30 minutes. I did 100 push-ups and 100 sit-ups. Um, did some curling. Did some shrugs. Just feeling some soreness today. So today, so far, earlier in the day, I was able to get on exercise bike for 30 minutes. I went like just under eight miles. Ooh, time ring. And the blog post, still have shots on me. Maybe I can zip around to this. And scoot up the hill. scoot this way beautiful need some I need some optics that'll be my goal use this money give me something nice give me something reliable something with some range something with uh, more shots in it this doesn't feel like the bolt cycles very cleanly on the uh, the old Mosin in this version so I probably will sell it despite my affection for that weapon and if I sell that uh, Plus the money from this mission, I should be sitting pretty to get something real nice for next week and I'll be able to go pretty far. Because I think with some decent optics and a good, a good amount of ammo, I could pretty confidently push out and see what I can find. Spend some time. This is a top priority mission, so who knows what it's going to unlock. Uh, get pretty comfortable sleeping out here, bringing enough stuff to go. We're going to make some serious headway into 1.0. Feeling pretty good about that. I feel like today went almost flawlessly. Uh, especially since I didn't know what I was up against. I'm very happy with it. I'm gonna get done doing this, get some more exercise in. Not gonna work the same muscle groups today that I did yesterday if I can help it. Um, maybe I'll do some of that uh, thrill of the fight boxing for cardio in addition to the half hour bike ride and stuff and then maybe do some good stretching uh, and be ready to run again tomorrow. I think I'd feel pretty good about that be a good day be a good day join the discord check out the uh self-improvement category let's do this let's uh let's get healthy let's get happy feel better we'll uh, we'll include learning in there something cool you learned today that you think other people should check out something beneficial the world's changing every day ai is going to change everything right it's going to change the world so maybe the best tool that you could learn is how to think you know what i mean and if you want to think clearly, you got to be fairly healthy. So be healthy, learn how to think, study some philosophy, share it back and forth, open your eyes to the world, how it really operates, not like the imaginary ideas that some people have. Uh, you'll be prepared for the changes that come. Prepare yourself to be flexible, to adapt to what you need to adapt to, to go forward, be happy, go further, enjoy your life. You know what I mean? Find your strengths, find how you can improve yourself in those strengths, apply that. We'll do it together, we'll work together. And I'm not trying to preach at anybody. I'm nobody, I'm just some guy who plays video games on YouTube, you know what I mean? Come here, hang out, share your time with me playing these games, watching these games, I'm nobody, right? So you can talk to me 
in a way that you can't talk to other people. Let's talk about this for a second. It's like trying to tell your mom that you got some kind of problem. Dude, it's hard. It's hard because you want that person to approve of you. You don't, and there's like this, this, this heavy pressure, the judgment. Unless you got a special relationship with your parents, right? Which I honestly never felt comfortable sharing certain things, right? That's tough. But you can share with me because I'm nobody and I'm not going to judge you. I'm going to help you. I'm going to help you in any way that you want me to help you. I'm going to try to encourage you. Uh, I'll point out things that you maybe, maybe you know deep down. A lot of this stuff, honestly, is just being honest with yourself. You know. You can feel it. You know what you're doing wrong. You know what you could do better. You can feel that. You know every day it bothers you just a little bit, but you distract yourself, right? We work together. We can make this stuff happen. And there's absolutely no pressure of judgment because I am nobody. I'm just some dude on the internet that likes to play video games. 3K. I didn't get the optional ejection, that's okay. I'm alright with it. We're at 8,800, that's gonna be nice. We'll, uh, we'll consider what loadout we're gonna get. Um, let's sell some stuff. Let's see if we can get some turn-ins, because I did find... Um, I think it's a night eye. Yeah, I found a night eye. If we got a quest for a night eye, or maybe one of those uh, spawn cores or fragment cores, that'd be great. We'll check that out real quick. We'll sell some of this extra junk, it's gonna be... You know what? I'm pretty happy with today. Feeling good. Alright. What do you want? The blank artifact ain't got it. Night Eye. That's what I'm talking about. Go turn in this Night Eye. Sweet. And who knows what we'll get up to next week. It's wild to me that, like, the different doors open. Bang. Not bad. 9,100. Maybe we could even get a, an M4. That gun feels amazing in this game, or it does in the newer version anyway. Hmm. Photos. We could go ahead and take that mission, but uh, we'll think about it. We'll think about it. We'll think about it. Um... We'll check next week. Go ahead and sell everything else we have. Feel good about today. Didn't use much ammo. Really did, very, took very little damage. Won't cost much at all. Yeah. Not bad at all. Ate just a little bit of food, but we've got plenty of that. So let's sell some of this stuff. Get rid of this Makarov. magazine go ahead and get rid of that uh, everything else I think we're keeping so if you've got a guess at what this stuff and thing might be worth we'll sweeten the pot just that little more what do you think what do you think you got a number in your head was that your number it's not amazing but it's not bad feeling pretty good about today 9500 not bad at all took very little damage uh, stress level stayed fairly low you really have to move patiently through this game through these zones uh, but I'm happy with the result today next week we'll get some decent gun we'll think about that buy something something with a little bit of optics something with more ammo something with a little more hit uh, that'll be that'll be a huge boon out there exploring this version of the game and then hopefully I can start kind of learning the routes that are a little easier to navigate my progress is so slow avoiding anomalies and shockers etc um, it's very difficult to make decent headway out there it's not like the newer version of the game where you can move very quickly through a lot of sections of the map maybe there are some roads out there that are better and I'll learn them um, I will go ahead and try to test this one thing for the average adult gamer I think he wanted to see if you could balance stuff hmm, that didn't work I don't know if I can do it with this. Maybe that's the problem. Maybe it's this object. Let's try uh, spare Makarov and something here. Let me check this out for you, bro. I thought you just, like... I guess not. Maybe I'm thinking about this wrong. I don't know. 
We'll give that a minute and see if it sets. Okay. Comment, buddy, if I did that wrong and you want me to try to test it a different way. But in my opinion, it doesn't look like that trick works in this version of the game. Um, but I've only done it once before, and that was a while back. We'll sit down think about what we learned real quick. Uh, I think today was a pretty good day. I'm in a better space mentally. Uh, so it felt better to play. I enjoyed this. Um, I'm enjoying this new physical fitness thing that I'm leaning into harder. I'm looking forward to sharing that with some of you. Again, if you're interested, uh, join the Discord. Link in the description. Uh, we're also doing regular game nights. And then our community managers, which I call Sherpas because I think it's funny, um, have been organizing events. We did a golf tournament. I'm working on the video for that. Um, it'll probably just be a highlight reel and stuff. But the winner of that tournament walked away with, not only did they get to play a multiplayer game with me, which I'll play with anybody, so that's not really a reward because I'll just do that anyhow. But they get to play a multiplayer game with me, maybe create a video on it if they want to. Uh, and then I also gifted them a copy of Light Brigade on Quest 2, which I think is pretty uh, pretty awesome for just showing up and playing a game and then winning, right? Uh, yeah, that was a, it's been a fun couple of weeks in the Discord. I enjoy it thoroughly, hanging out with them. It's my favorite place in social media right now. So everything else, everybody's mad and fighting. And they're worried about being right and not necessarily making any kind of progress with themselves. Nobody's honest with themselves. And, I've noticed if, if I have a disagreement with somebody online in social media, usually they don't even tell you if you were right or they were wrong. They just ghost you. Um, and it was like, my goal wasn't to be my, right. My goal was to have a conversation. I saw a flaw in somebody's logic pointed out to them, and they ghost you because they were more interested in winning the argument. It's, it's not a contest, bro. It's like you're trying to improve each other through, through discussion. Um, people have lost sight of that. They've attached their egos to brands and viewpoints and it's not necessary and it gets in the way of learning any everything if you already know everything you're not going to learn anything you know there's a there's a humility required to learn and people are just more interested in being right they're more interested in having attention uh it's it's really it's uncomfortable out there which is why i enjoy the discord so much like i feel like you can have real conversations there and get to know each other and, and root for each other and hope for the best and, and you know observe each other's lives and want want people to do better and go further and feel that in return. It's nice. But uh, I've, I've rattled on long enough. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this run. Uh, as always, this game uh, brings a smile to my face. I've been playing it for a long time, and I still have a good time. I feel like I learned something. The mechanics are so good, the loop is so good, that even though I've seen pretty much everything there is to see in the newer version, uh, I'm not tired of playing. And I still like going out here and seeing the new stuff in 1.0 is great. It's got a, a lot left to see, a lot left to see. Because every time I go out further, I'm blown away at the map and detail that has been removed from the modern version of the game. Like that road with the cars, that was awesome. And then the harvesters, it seems like such a cool entity. I can't believe they've removed it uh, and I guess replaced it with the BTR, which in my opinion is a much less interesting entity than the harvester. But I will wrap it up. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Hopefully you had a good week. Hopefully you got some fun weekend plans. Hopefully you're spending your free time with the people you want to spend your free time with. Thank you for watching. Thank you for supporting the Steiny channel. Have a nice day.